Hello dear friends and partners from FPC Bonita Springs. Uh, this is Dimitri and I wanted to take the time to thank you and uh, just to share my heart and uh, what we are praying for while we're serving the Lord here in Bulgaria. In the last uh, year and a half the Lord has been working in our hearts to make our vision and mandate even more clear than it used to be and uh, I'm thankful I'm thankful uh, for what the Lord has given us for what he has granted us for what for the special mission that, that he has given us and the partners like First Presbyterian and Bonita Springs and uh, in person I want to thank you or my friends that I know uh, from the meetings I have had in uh, Florida you're very special to our hearts you're very special to our ministry uh, recently, the Lord uh, pointed my attention to a scripture passage, and I want to read it to you. I will recount the steadfast love of the Lord, the praises of the Lord, according to all that the Lord has granted us, and the great goodness to the house of Israel. And we know Israel to be the image of the New Testament church, that he has granted them according to his compassion according to the abundance of his steadfast love. Surely, he said, they are my people, the children who will not deal falsely. The Lord trusts somehow he has such a heart that trusts in his people and their love for him and their, commi their commitment to the ministry and mission and the mandate that the Lord has given us. And we at New Hope, we believe the Lord has given us a mandate to preach the gospel, to raise a new generation of believers, to equip a new generation of ministry workers, to reach out to those that have never heard the gospel in a comprehensive and understandable way, to reach those children, youth, and families, and give them Christ so that they can come to the Lord and know Him, love Him, obey Him and become his followers and we're thankful we're thankful that you as partners have given us so much your love your prayers your financial support to help us fulfill the mandate and the mission that the lord has given us we are very pleased uh, to have you and we are thankful i want to challenge you and appeal to you in these very difficult circumstances and times for our ministry and our nation to pray for us. Recently uh, we began to see uh, re refugee camps being built 15 kilometers away from our city and uh, today we have uh, Syrian refugees coming to our area and they will be living with us for a while. We want to be of service, we want to be effective and fruitful and making new disciples and even reaching out to those special people who have been ravaged by war and especially that civil war in Syria. We want to have the church as a new hope involved in this ministry to the people that are living now uh, are next door as our neighbors just 15 kilometers away from us and their number is growing. We don't want to be afraid of refugees. Many people are afraid of what's coming, what's the future. But we know the Lord to hold us in His own precious hand. He holds His believers. He really keeps us safe. That's His promise. He will never leave us nor forsake us. And uh, we pray to have more friends like you, like First Presbyterian Bonita Springs. Please pass our love, our prayers, our greetings to the congregation. And I'm looking forward to see you again next year. Thank you. And God bless you.